Feeling Let's good? Go. <laughs> are friends with some beekeepers so we have come out um, today they are harvesting the honey so I think we get to don some beekeeping suits and I don't know if we're involved with lifting out the honeycombs or not but we'll see you'll see I hope I don't have to get that close <laughs> I just saw a bee Hi Harley, how are you? I'm good. good to see you again. It's been like three days. So oh yeah, and then it sounds very good. Yeah, yeah. What's your reaction before you uh, set foot on the I'm really nervous by the and I'm curious what keeps them from coming up my legs. Is there any it cinches, doesn't it? No. You can put your socks on the outside. Oh, there you go. I'll do that. I don't know that. <laughs> Feeling good? <Let's> go. <laughs> I can show you. Well, you can. Well, what, where's that safe distance in there? Yeah. So talk to her. You're all in there. Awesome. Ready. Oh, there's a little hole in your netting here. <laughs> Yeah, I kind of feel bad. Oh, yeah, it's smoking. I'm really nervous. No, you're gonna be fine. What's that? So there's really gonna be a lot of bees. So if you're at any point you're not comfortable, just back up. Yeah, it's supposed to calm them down. Oh. Oh, wow. I almost would think it did the opposite. Yeah, I think it. they uh, get concerned and start trying to eat honey instead of trying to attack whoever's taking their honey. Oh. It's a good system. look. Fantastic. This is our best hive this year. Really? So is this the first time looking, getting a look at this since um, uh, You know, we, we look at them every week. Oh, okay. And so we've seen this hive a few times. Oh, okay. Oh, you can see cool. that honey. See the honey, Macy? Yeah. Yeah, this one's looks looks pretty great. good. So now what we're going to do is uh, we're going to start knocking the bees off of this frame. And I'm going to hand the frames to somebody, mm -hmm. and then somebody not you. No, not you. <laughs> is going to put them in the box yep. okay. over by the four-wheeler. So, Brad, if you want to, you can do either one of those jobs. Where's the? Hey, Ray, do you have the brush? I don't. Oh, you guys seem a little close to me, though. Know? I would go on the other side of the grate. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta get all the bees off and try to. And yeah. people who do this for real do it with chemicals. You know, they put like a something the bees don't like in the hive and kind of drive them out. Oh, okay. Or they blow them out with big blowers. Uh huh. But we just smoke them and then brush them off and. This is the traditional way? Uh, I don't even know. Oh. Uh, it's the way we do it. Yeah. So there are much more elegant ways to do this than just shaking them off. But it's pretty <laughs> entertaining though, honestly. Yeah. That's interesting. We always
always get a few bees in the house, but... Hey, Macy? Yeah? You want to hold this frame full of bees? Or no? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Smart girl. Yeah. Want to take that and give it to Ray? How you doing, Brad? Um, this buzzing is a little unnerving. Well... It's very loud. It's kind of like the drone, though, so just pretend it's a drone being flown around. Yeah. So pretty soon all the bees that were in there are going to be outside, so where do they go then? Well, when we leave, they'll go back in. Oh, okay. At least that's the idea. <laughs> you hope they don't follow for too long. Wow. It's it unbelievable how many there are before he shakes it off. Usually we have about ten. So, oh, so the rest of these aren't ready? They are. Well, they'll they'll come we'll down, down with other folks. Oh, gotcha. We'll come back and get those. Well, thanks for giving us such an awesome close-up view of everything. You're more than welcome. And that is great. That's just half. Now we'll go in and we'll extract that honey. Okay. And uh, bottle it. And wow. I'm ready. I'll go this way and take all the bees. <laughs> this oh, way. yeah. They'll follow Away that. from the honey. <laughs> the sleeves will fit into the cages. And then... Oh. And just centrifugal oh. force makes it fall out or what? Uh-huh. Oh, cool. Huh. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Sorry. Oh, oh, nice oh, 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 let's see if they come out. Let me see that, that. Lily is actually a professional. Yeah, she's the best one. Okay, so what is that? This one doesn't have any caps on it, so there's no honey to get out of it. <laughs> well, there's a couple, so there might be like a little bit of honey in there. But this is all just the wax. All right, all right. It's like a gallon in there already. Absolutely. There you go. Oh, very nice. Right. Very Well, we couldn't stay for the whole process until the jarring happened, but um, later Ted brought us a jar of this liquid gold. And we just wanted to say um, thank you so much for letting us be a part of that. And it was an amazing experience, and thank you so much for the hike. Can't wait to try it. <laughs> <laughs>